Um, tell us, uh, tell us about these shoes right here, man. Okay, they got a uh, snake skin right here. Sí, son de de vibra, vibra. Rattlesnake, brother. Rattlesnake boots. Um, you've been living here in Los Angeles for a few years now. Um, you're getting a fight here, obviously a, a, a fighter from Los Angeles, native from Los Angeles. Do you feel that the fan support um, will be kind of split or do you think maybe more on his side just because he's Mexican? How do you think that's going to go? Sí, creo que va a haber de ambos lados porque la gente me ha apoyado mucho el tiempo que estoy acá y sabe que soy un terreno y que le muestro todo arriba arriba. He says that um, yeah, he feels that the the fan base will be the same equally because he's been here for a while and he's got a lot of fans out here and he sees it that way. It'll be an equal amount of fans. Um, I want to get your opinion on recent comments by Floyd Mayweather. He was saying that uh, he believes these fighters nowadays are getting paid too much money and that he was going to talk to Al Heyman about uh, you know like lowering the purses on these guys. What, what's your take on on that? Being that the fact that the guy's name is, is Money Mayweather. Dice, ¿qué opinas de la, de, del comentario que acaba de hacer reciente de Floyd Mayweather? Que él había dicho que los boxeadores de ahora les pagan demasiado dinero por sobre las bolsas de pelea, que no merecen eso, que él iba a hablar con Heyman para que les estuviera bajando la bolsa a todos los boxeadores que no merecen estar haciendo demasiado dinero. ¿Tú qué opinas de eso, sabiendo que él es un boxeador de dinero? Depende, depende la, la, la categoría de los rivales. Puede ser, puede ser que hay unos boxeadores, pero todo, todo merece. Esto es un negocio y tiene que ser que, que, que todo gane. He says, uh, well, sure, you know, depending on what type of fights you're talking about, you know, there's other type of guys that don't deserve big purses. But he sees this as a business, you know, and and depending on the outcome of the fights, you know, depending on the style, I mean the the amount of fights that the, the fighter is or the low, the level of the fight that he's given, you know. And me extraña, me extraña eh, que lo diga si él, si él también vende, vende y la gente lo, lo sigue. Aunque and no it, quiera de perder ganar, pero lo, eh, es, it, la motivación está que la, la gente lo vea. It's, it's what uh, amazes him is that it's coming out of Floyd's mouth, you know, especially that people come and see him lose or, or win anyways, you know, it's people going to come to see them. So, and fanatic, uh, the fan base is always going to come and see boxing regardless of whether they're making a big purse or not, you know. That's why it amazes him that he said that. Este my way or not my way. Todo, todo, toda la gente fanática de boxeo en el mundo va a apoyar el boxeo y va a seguir viendo el boxeo. Whether Floyd Mayweather is there or not, you know, fans are always going to be there for boxing, you know, and it's not about that. You're a... Um one of the latest fighters, uh, or I guess kind of newest fighters out of Argentina that, that the public's been able to see. Uh, but there's been some great fighters, obviously, recently. Uh, Martinez, uh, Maidana, Matisse. W what is it about, like, in Argentina, was there, like, something different that happened or something that, that boxing that all of a sudden now there's a surge of, of Argentinian boxers in the game? Dice que hay varios boxeadores como que han venido de Argentina. ¿Qué es lo que estaba pasando en Argentina? Como Lucas Matisse, Chino Maidana. Uh, Maravilla Martínez, qué es lo que sucedió para que todos los boxeadores argentinos empezaran a llegar. Como tú eres un boxeador que acaba de llegar aquí en Estados Unidos y la gente te quiere ver. No, creo que, creo que ellos, ellos dieron lo, los primeros pasos y, lo, y los boxeadores de abajo se están animando un poco más a, a salir al exterior y saben que tienen potencial y es lo que van a ver. Sí, y es lo que hago yo. Dice que Maidana, Maidana y esos guys open, paid the, the, the way for them to come out from Argentina and it's a lot easier now for them to come out and compete nationally now and be known and seen out there in the world now. Uh, the, uh, kind of a style, every, every kind of country has a different style it seems like. Uh, American fighters, you know, uh, can be flashy, Mexican fighters are kind of known to be tough. Uh, Argentina fighters seem to have, uh, seem to be big punching, uh, power punchers. Would you agree with that and, and why is that? Dice que boxeadores, hay estilos boxeadores como los americanos, tienen el estilo de, de moverse y estar haciendo show para la cámara, los mexicanos son guerreros fuertes, los argentinos son boxeadores pegaduros y pegan fuerte, ¿es cierto? Sí, sí prácticamente todos todo lo, los argentinos tienen, tienen poder en sus puños y, y se entrenan, son dedicados. Yeah, he says Argentinos are known to have power in their fist, you know, and they train themselves really hard. For fights like this, you know. Uh, give us a prediction, man. How does uh, how does the fight December 10th end with you and Abdur Mahrez? Que le digas una predicción. ¿Cómo cómo 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 va a pasar esta pelea el 10 de diciembre de tu y Mahrez? ¿En qué va a quedar? Me voy a me estoy preparando muy duro. Sé que estoy en perfectas condiciones y me va a llevar la victoria para Argentina y así.
because he's another campeon. He says, uh, I'm training myself really hard for this fight. I prepare myself very well for this fight. Uh, it's going to be a rough fight, uh, but on December 10, I'm going to take my, my victory back to Argentina. Is, is there any extra pressure on you to make the performance look even greater, just being that there's so many big names at your division right now? Dice que piensas que tú ahora en esta pelea vas a tener que hacer tu pelea más excitante porque sabiendo que hay boxeadores de nivel muy grande en tu división ahora. Sí, sí que eh, estoy entre entre todos los, los mejores plumas y lo vamos a cruzar. Es la, es la, la idea con José Bastián Contus y Gemón que, que vamos a cruzarlo. Yo, yo estoy dispuesto a pelear con ellos y me, quedarme una pelea más en, en pluma. He says, yeah, I mean, uh, I know I trained myself for these fights. Uh, my manager, we talked about it, Sebastian Contursi and Al Heyman, you know, that I want to, I know I'm one of the top 10, 10 or 5 fighters in the division, and I want to stay here for at least two more fights and fight them, you know, fight the big fights, and that's why I want to make a big impact on this fight on December 10th. Jesus, uh, best of luck, man. Always appreciate the time, and I uh, can't wait to see you perform. Yeah, muchísimas gracias. Gracias por la oportunidad.